Okay. Had a uh, unexpected diversion there. Plants changed. I'm, uh, I got my coffee and I just got dropped off at Dunkin' Donuts, or actually I'm at the corner of 951 and um, Lockley Road. So I'm now, instead of riding to Dunkin' Donuts, I'm riding back. I rode about three miles towards it, and actually total distance this will probably wind up being longer than 10 miles. So. See how it goes. A nice little walking uh, biking trail that runs along Collier Boulevard. Okay, let's try this. Gotta pick it up. hear that headwind it is bad really bad not sure if I'm gonna be able to make it back started this second leg of the journey here it said I had 14 miles of battery life left so it'd be quite interesting to see uh, if I make it because I bet this is this is probably a I don't know 10 mile an hour headwind so the bot is having to work uh, extra extra hard I know what it's like to pedal against this so it's not fun The many, many churches on Immokalee Road. This headwind is bad. Very bad. It's actually like blowing me around a little bit. This is definitely a boring ride. It's hot. feet hurt. This isn't a ride I'm going to need to duplicate on a, a regular basis, that's for sure. Just stepped off for a little break. This is my average uh, speed, 10.6. And um, it says I have nine miles of uh, range left be enough but we'll see holy crap it's had a headwind that just like it just almost like totally stopped me this is definitely a different kind of challenge putting my arm out isn't a good thing more wind drag my first uh, tilt back slow and steady slow and steady I'm about halfway should have about five miles to go I'm uh, stopping semi regularly just to grab a pole and uh, shift my feet a little bit Tell 
the back. I have a feeling it's, um, it's because of uh, lower battery levels. Alright, so it just tilted me back real hard again, real fast, real hard, and uh, I stepped off again, about went down the trench. So, I don't know if there's anything I can do to adjust it. If I set the, the hardness to zero, maybe it'll help. But that tilt back, it just, it's, I mean, I got to beat for a couple seconds and all of a sudden just freaking tilt back like crazy. So, uh, yeah, it's not cool. I'm about uh, three miles from home. Let me see what the phone says. <sighs> Luckily, I don't think I sustained any major injuries there. Six miles. And down to yellow battery life. Six miles. Bot temperature 133, 134. I think part of the problem is also with all the road noise and um, wind. Maybe I'm not hearing all the beeps. I don't know. Maybe. But that tilt back's got to go, man. It's killing me. Rolling again. Another wipeout. I think the camera was actually rolling that time. So it's exciting. I'm having Cindy meet me at uh, Ease. So I only have to go like maybe another mile or so. I proved my point. Sunny, it's actually raining a little bit right now. Yeah, it just tilted back real hard on me again. It wasn't even going that fast because of the low battery. But I mean, it can't. It's too far for tilt back, man. All right, I just got to run super slow, I guess. Another reason like a, a higher end wheel like an ACM 16 that has a lot of range, more power, I guess you would have less of this. Not sure how fast I'm going, definitely slower, just trying to get there without any more tilt back. It's getting bad. I was going slow there and got tipped back. Five miles. Hopefully I can make it this last mile or so. Yeah, at least, at least for me this is pretty much unrideable at this point, even though it says it has five miles to go. The tilt back hits quick and it's so severe I, I can't stay on it. So. Too. too far of a ride, definitely too far. Probably uh, slow run speed right now. I've got like a couple hundred yards to go, Let's see if I can make it. Annoying as hell. My chase vehicle. 